Now we will we will enter the to give our customer the living living tester. Yeah. So we have the Cat 5e solution, Cat 6 and the Cat 6a, maybe Cat 8 solution. Yeah, one by one. So please give us a couple minutes to prepare the stuff. Yeah. So first, uh, first, uh, we test the Cat 5e UTP solution. Yeah, we have a cable. The length will be about 90 meter. We have one, two, and two end connection. The white, white is very traditional color. And we have the fluke tester. And we also will test the permanent link. We will. It's a very good idea to support us. Okay, let's let's see. Okay, now you know we have we have a lot of choice from the tester. Sometimes we will follow the TIA standard from America. Sometimes we will choose the local standard in your country, maybe the ISO also. So now at this at this uh, case we sub, we choice the TIA standard. Let's 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 see the uh, parameter. You will see the next very good. About uh, nine point six dB. Yeah, that's very good. So, if you have interest in about the classic five E, maybe you see the two connection is not enough. Please give a message. What kind of what kind of model you would like? Maybe three connector or four connector. Okay. Next, uh, we will choose from K five E to K six. Let's see what happened. What's the result from K five E to K six? Now, now we will change the yeah. Every time we will spend more than fifty seconds to test because we choose all parameter. If you choose a basic parameter, that's a best bet. That's very quickly, only five or six seconds. Yeah. So okay, we now we change to the Cat six cable. Uh, this this color is orange. That means in Zhaolong, that means this uh, the outer jacket will be low smoking zero hundred LHCS rate. Okay, let's start. This time we still choose a TIA standard K six A K six permanent link plus all parameter. Yeah, let's see. It pass and the next uh, will about uh, six dB. Yeah, yeah you know, uh, a lot of module may be used in your project. Maybe you don't care the ninety meter. You will focus on the small. Uh, the, the the short link maybe fifteen meter maybe twenty meter. Give us your feedback and then we will give you example. Yeah. So now we test the K five E K six. Now we change to the K six A. The K six A we have two different specs. One is unshield, another is shield design. So now we prepared the, the stuff is K six A U slash FTP uh, design. Yeah. Good. You can see we still have the 90 meter permanent link, and we also connection to outlet before that. So let's see what happened. This cable is a very good idea if you use the remember the new update Wi-Fi technology such as the Wi-Fi six. That's very good. Yeah, we need a couple of seconds. Yeah, 
we got a good performance, the next parameter will more than 8 dB. You know, we have a bunch of design uh, solution in Zhaolong. For example, this is the 23 AWG. If you have interest in the small diameter K6A, for example, we have an, another design, K6A 24 AWG spec. We also can give you an example. Please give us a message. Now, we test K5E, K6, and K6A. The last one, we will show you the CAT grade 8 solution. You know the CAT 8, the length, not 90 meter, you know, that's crazy. We only support 24 meter plus 6 meter according to, according to the ISO standard. Yeah, so you can see uh, the, the purple, the couple, couple cable is 24 meter and the, the gray cable is 6 meter, totally 30 meter. Yeah. So we also use the stuff, you see the MPTL stuff replaced the, the traditional outlet. Category A solution can support 25 giga, maybe 40 giga in the data center. So the 30 meter is maybe not not uh, less enough, but still very according to the uh, international standard. Yeah. So let's change the standard to category eight and to set up the testing. Yeah, we need more time. This time we still use the TIA standard and the parameter is good, eh? about um, near 5 dB. Let's show detail. According to the research by some, by some university, category 8 maybe can expand to 50 meter, maybe expand to 100 meter in, in the in future. We have we have no idea what will happen in, in future, but uh, you know that's the upgrade technology. Currently, you support uh, 40 giga or 25 giga in your data center. Yeah. 